Hey, welcome to another edition of A Better Life. I'm Dr. Lucas Fry, and I tell you what, we've got some exciting guests on this week. And uh, as a homeowner, there's always things that you need to take care of. And uh, the first guest up, of course, is uh, we're going to be dealing with pest control. But before I get to him, I do want to remind you that later on the show, we'll be giving away a $75 gift certificate to Icky Bonds. And we appreciate them uh, participating in the show, along with, of course, uh, uh, Billy Ann's Flowers, who provides our nice floral arrangements. Welcome to our new set. This is our virtual reality set. We're premiering it on this show. We're excited. If you like it, email me at WLFT.com. And, of course, love us on Facebook and watch all of the episodes, the past episodes included on YouTube, uh, WLFT TV 30. We invite you to do that. So, uh, welcome to the show of Mr. Frank O. How you doing, Frank O? I'm doing well. Doctor. What is the actual last name? Obi. 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 Yes. And where are you from, Frank? Um, grew up in Baton Rouge, but I uh, now live in Zachary, Louisiana. Oh, okay. Yes. So, uh, you're used to this area and the problems that homeowners have as far as pest control. Yes, sir. How long have you been in pest control? Uh, been in pest control for about 13 and a half years. Wow, so you've uh, seen your share of infestations. I have, yes. Now, sir. I have a home in South Carolina, did uh, several homes in uh, other places that I've lived in the past few years. Um, things are a little bit different in Baton Rouge. You have, a, right now, we have the woolly worms that are, seem to be falling out of the trees everywhere, and everybody says, don't touch those, they'll kill you, or whatever, I don't know. But what is the main thing this type of, of year, we're, we're in May, of course, going into May, what is the main thing people need to be doing to protect their homes? Well, uh, I guess the first thing would, uh, what would you protect? I mean, what would you spray your yard or you need to work you, on the house? You, what uh, do you need to work on? Just put a protective barrier around your home. What, uh, what do you use to do that? We use quite a few different products, uh, whether it's a tall store or um, some people use a, a, a termidor, which is mainly for termites. Right. Uh, the main thing you want to do is keep your, your soil below your slab. Um, you don't, you don't keep want Keep it treated. Yeah, keep and it treated. That's where the problems begin? Yes, sir. So, uh, and that's the termite bond that I have on my properties? Is that what that's taken care of? Yes, sir. And you recommend that? Yes, sir. Absolutely. And what does a termite bond run in this particular uh, area of the country? The, the prices yeah. typically run from five to thousand dollars. That's the average price. Five hundred to a thousand? Yeah, that's on the that's average That's year? Okay. Yes. So uh, that, that gives you a warranty, too. If you're ever infested, uh, yes. the insurance takes it. That includes like an insurance, right? Yeah. Once you do your initial treatment, right. um, then you go on a what you call a renewal. Uh, we're responsible for your home for one year, and then after one year, you go on a renewal. You know, we'll you. call you back once a year and ask, would you like to continue the contract? And most people say yes. And okay. So uh, other than termites, what are some of the other things that are a real problem in Baton Rouge that people need to watch out for? That well, would cause damage to their home. Uh, wood destroying insects would be uh, your termite, your carpenter bees, your carpenter ants. Uh, we now have a, a major problem in certain areas with uh, what they call uh, uh, some Argentine ants, uh, mm. raspberry Argentine, uh, Caribbean ants. And what do they do? They uh, they are large in numbers. Uh, oh. Their colonies consist of millions to billions of ants, and uh, when they attack a structure they come in large numbers wow. and can be very pesty. Wow. Um, so you have fire ants down here too? We do have fire, have fire ants. ants. Yes. And what do you, do you treat for that kind of stuff too? I mean, if a person has problems in their home, you'll come yes, out sir. and do those type of things too? Yes, sir, we do. And of course, do you have mice and rats and stuff in the back <laughs> there? Lots of mice and rats. Lots of mice and rats. And yes, what do you recommend as far as that? What do you use around the, do you have a, a particular plan that you use or that you well, recommend? We start off trapping. Um, if you would to have a problem. If you have but, if it, a yeah. lot of them run around, I guess, the, yeah. The main thing is to, uh, to exclusion work. Make sure you seal up all your pipes, uh, entry points into your home, uh, door seals, things of that nature. I got you, spray it around it. Okay, so what about flying insects in the summer? I mean, I, I was here a for a couple of years and I noticed people have them gizmos outside their house and it's, you know, flashing zzz, zzz, zzz. And uh, I've tried that myself as far as where I live. Uh, it doesn't seem to be very effective. Is there anything else that you recommend that will, as far actually, as what to do? Actually, uh, we've been pretty successful with uh, uh, lawn treatments, uh, treating the lawns, hmm. kind of, uh, treating your shrubberies, uh, sh trees, things of that nature. Uh, some companies do offer misting systems. Um, but that, that, it all the, starts in the bushes and yeah. in the ground. The things that are flying around at night, they come from somewhere. That's where yes, they come sir. from. Yes. 
Wow, that's pretty neat. All right, so uh, is, if a person lives in a condominium, uh, do, you, do you find that uh, uh, trying to protect their property is harder than a person has just their own home because there's other people next door and things like people live in an apartment? Do you offer services for individuals renting apartments or renting yes. condos? And you, you can have uh, effective treatments with just a single condominium. Uh, most condominiums, uh, associations do have a, a company to come out and treat that whole complex. Right, but if a person with a, with a stature lives in an apartment complex where people have dogs and cats right next door and stuff, it becomes a problem sometimes. And so mm -hmm. I guess you have ways to protect their, their individual property. We do, yes sir. That's great. All right, so how do you get hold of your company? It's uh, the best way to do is a phone number, I believe? Yes sir, you can reach me at uh, area code 225-772-1876. Cool. And that's uh, Frank O's Pest Control. I'm telling you, that's great. And I guess you're licensed and bonded and all that kind of stuff. Yes, sir. Let's I go. Licensed and bonded by the state of Louisiana. Yes, sir. How many employees do you have? I have three, two employees. Wow. Mm -hmm. Growing, huh? Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. What's yeah. the biggest challenge you found in Baton Rouge as far as hiring employees? Uh, I guess finding good workers. People that want to actually People do the work. People that actually want to do the work. Yeah. Okay. Uh, is it a sales job too, or going door to door? Or how do you get your leads, or just people mostly calling in? Uh, I do a lot of networking. Yeah. Um, joined a couple of organizations, uh, which is a BNI, uh, and also a PBN group, and uh, we network and we sell each other's business. I got so you. So I, I do a lot of get a lot of business that Good. way. Well, maybe you'll try television, too. You never know. Yeah. Hey, if you're interested in pest control, why don't you get a hold of Franco? And uh, we recommend him. He does a good job, and everybody that we've talked to about him says you can't go wrong, and you can trust this guy. So, hey, protect your property, protect your family, get the proper pest control, and you'll have a better life. When we come back, we have another exciting guest. Plus, later on the show, we're going to be telling you how you can win a $75 gift certificate from a nice eating Japanese restaurant called Ikebons. Great place to eat, and I think you'll enjoy it. Right now, a word from our sponsors, people who care about a better life. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. South Louisiana, there's no better time to call than right now to get the best quality made Ella walk-in tub or shower from Easy Baths of Louisiana. Call now. 289-4141 and let Easy Baths of Louisiana show you the low entry and easy access walk-in tubs and showers. Our walk-in tubs come with easy to use controls, stainless steel door and dual 80 second drain with chromotherapy lighting, automatic cleaning, hydrotherapy jets and much much more. Easy Baths of Louisiana guarantees the absolute lowest prices on the same or equal products with our 10% back guarantee. We offer easy pay financing with great rates. If you call right now and mention this ad, we'll take an incredible $750 off our already low prices with this TV offer. Welcome back to A Better Life. I'm Dr. Fry, and I tell you, the clock is running, so we want to be sure that we get everything in here that we got to get in today. I had a lady that was on a while back, and I really liked having her on the show, and the time went so fast, there was just no chance for us to really talk about all the cool stuff she does. Her name is Shannon LeBlanc, and she is with a particular travel agency that specializes in doing things for couples. What was the name of the company? Paradise Vacation Escapes. And tell us a little bit why you started that company. Well, um, I started it because of my passion for travel, and I love to travel with my partner, and he and I love to just take as many honeymoons as we can. <laughs> <laughs> honeymoons are good for the relationship, exactly, no doubt. Exactly, exactly. And so your, your trips all kind of specialize in romantic type of, of, of getaways, right? Yes, I work with loving couples that want to escape everyday life and get away to reconnect with each other. So I do that by creating fabulous honeymoons, romantic journeys, and uh, memorable vacations that bring them closer together. Now, do you get a lot of letters from the people that you book saying thank you? I've been getting a lot of great testimonials lately <laughs> from couples. Um, in fact, just recently, this past weekend, I had a 
letter and a picture from a couple that went to Cabo for their 25th anniversary. Mm. And um, they just loved the experience and loved being there and loved the fact that they didn't have to do anything. I had everything taken care of. Too cool. Yes. All right, we brought some pictures that yes. we're going to be showing here in just a second. And uh, let's, let's, let's just have him go full screen on it and let's see what the first picture is and tell us a little bit about this particular place. Okay. Oh, so, that looks like you a lot. Yeah, okay. that's me. That's, <laughs> that's all right. You were there. And yes. Now where and are we okay, at? Okay, so now we're in Bora Bora, which is part of the French Polynesian Islands, a uh, part of Tahiti. Oh, it looks very pretty. Yes, and very people pretty. actually stay in those. Uh, well, you can't jump there. That's okay. Those uh, you are can, the over-the-water bungalows. Oh, the over-the-water bungalows. Yes. And you actually stay out there, and then you can just kind of, I guess, you jump off your balcony. You can jump off the and balcony your, and, and play jump with in the, the water. Uh, all right, hold those pictures. Don't run through them. Let's, let's right. talk about this. Now, what is this? This is the Storwood property, the St. Regis in Bora Bora. And uh, you may be familiar with it because this is where they filmed Couples Retreat with Vince Vaughn. Oh, yes, yes. And so, yeah, so um, it's, it's gotten very popular. Now, what does it cost to, to rent one of those? Um, for seven nights, you're looking at about... Eight thousand dollars. Wow! Just for the that's, um, that's really not that much. I mean, I do a lot of traveling, and a lot of the resorts are you know right. And that does include breakfast. I mean, it's over over the water bungalow. Um, you can see there's a pool on the deck. There's oh, yeah. an actual pool that you can swim swim on it. You know, privately, and you'll share it with the other bungalows. But that's one thing neat. That is really neat. Yes. That is really neat. Now, how long does it take to fly there? A day and a half. A day and a half to actually get there. Yes. And then, uh, so then you got seven nights there. So it's it's basically a 14 day. You need to right. walk off about 14 days. Easy right? if you want to go and really and enjoy yourself and and connect. You know, now, reconnect. What's with the, the next picture we got? This is another over the water bungalow. What's neat about these? I don't know if you can see the stairwell. You can just walk down the stairwell and go into the water. But in the water bungalows, they um, have part of the floors cut out. So you can actually bottom, see. So the you can see the fish. <laughs> so many tropical fish. And one of the resorts. I think is real neat. They have um, clear bathroom vanities. So while you're brushing your teeth, you can see fish swimming around. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's mountains there too, so there's lots yes. of different views. Is yes. there another picture in Bora that we want to see? Yes, yes, a lot of people enjoying oh, yeah. dinner in the water. Actually and, I mean, sitting in the water, the water in your bathing is. suit eating. Yes. Is that not too that's cool? That's enjoying life. Yeah, that's that's <laughs> called kicking back. I that think. is. I think Kenny Chesney's sitting right over there somewhere probably. Yeah, just, uh, really. Enjoying himself. <laughs> Is that all the pictures of Bora that we have? I believe that's that, that all was of Bora, okay. Bora All right, so Bora Bora is uh, located where? In the um, French Polynesian South Pacific Ocean. And so that's, and it takes a day and a half to get there. Where do people fly to first to get there? Um, you'll fly from New Orleans to L.A. Mm -hmm. And then from L.A. to Papati. Papati. I believe that's how you pronounce okay. it. I, I never know if I'm saying it right <laughs> or not. And then you'll take a small island plane. To Bora Bora. Now, you, when you quoted the cost, is it is that the, the, the inclusive of the airfare, or is there another your, There's your airfare? There's additional something? airfare. You're looking probably about ten thousand per the whole, couple for, the whole. for seven nights, air included, and most resorts include breakfast. Yes. So that's well, real good. Well, I tell you, that's a it's a it's a good investment in keeping your marriage on uh, on the right track. Right. I mean, right. It's a great idea. Great idea. Okay. So uh, we got some other pictures that yes. you brought. We want to uh, look at real quick. So right. what's uh, what's the next location that we're taking to? Let's see what he's going to show us next. Where's this at? Uh, this is in the Dominican Republic. Punta Cana. Wow, this what is, is that? A, is that a, a, a just like a, is that a place that you this stay? This is a resort. Or is this the, is the Hard Rock Resort. The Hard Rock Resort. Yes, it's an all-inclusive resort. Um, it's great for couples and for families. Hmm. Show us another picture. Let's. Okay. This is their bar area. So they're very um, just like Hard Rock cafes. Right. Um, pop oriented, music oriented. It's very contemporary. Yeah. Very. Very nice. modern. Yeah. Very, very modern. Very yes. hip. There Another picture we got? Oh, that's now, there the spa. you go. spa, yeah. Isn't yeah. that nice? <laughs> yeah, I could, I could see you getting to be hard to leave that particular area right there. Yes. That would be relaxing, no doubt. And very romantic for it a couple. It is romantic. And they also have a children's pool. So oh, separate, they have an adult course. pool and they have a children's pool. So if you know, you're there with your family, you can go and stay and play in the kitty area. And what's good about the Hard Rock Cafe is they offer a resort credit. Hmm. Uh, if you stay five nights or more, you get a $1,500 resort credit oh. on top of the all-inclusive wow. features. So, the, And the resort credit's good towards um, tours that the property offers, 
spa services, salon services, room upgrades, hmm. and different activities. Another picture? Ooh, you look can at also the get married there. Yeah, that's true. So destination always, weddings are beautiful. You could always get married or you could renew your vows. Exactly. Mm -hmm. There you go. Exactly. Any other pictures of this particular area? I believe this is it for that's it. Punta okay. Cana. Well, I tell you what, we're going to uh, take a break in just a second. Okay. And when we come back, what's the next place we're going to go to? I believe it's Antigua. Antigua we're going to talk yes. about. So we got some exciting places to talk about. You'll want to stay tuned as Shannon shares more of this information. And as you've seen on the screen, there's a ways to get hold of her. But of course, if you forget or you didn't get it written down, you always can email me at WLFT.com and we will put you directly in touch with Shannon. And uh, she just got a lot of places to talk about when we come back. So if you would, stay tuned. And remember, we got a contest going on where we're giving away a $75 gift certificate to Icky Bonds. And we're going to tell you more about that in the final segment of the show, too. Stay tuned. We'll be right back after a word from our sponsors. Hey, Baton Rouge and surrounding areas, it's your friend Jay, and I'm going to tell you the truth. If you want the best crawfish in town, you have got to go by the Crawfish Crib, located at 7869 Greenwell Springs Road and 9836 Florida Boulevard. Holler at Henry and ask him to hook you up with that Gold Rush garlic butter sauce on your crawfish and your crab legs, y'all. It's good. Have a good time. Welcome back to A Better Life. I'm Dr. Fry on our new virtual reality set. I'll tell you, I feel like I'm doing the world news report here, but uh, this is kind of cool because we're talking about places to go visit all around this beautiful world of ours. And with me on the show today is a lady by the name of Shannon LeBlanc, and uh, she does specialize in romantic getaways for couples. So if you're thinking about having a honeymoon or if you're wanting to just kind of rekindle the flame and show your wife that you really do appreciate her, this will get away from the cell phones, get away from the computers and just kind of chill for a few days. Right. Now, these the resorts that we're looking at, uh, and we're going to see some more here in a second, but uh, you said that they basically are seven-day type of things. Is that is that pretty common, what everybody does is a seven-day? Yeah, uh, most do seven. You can do five, mm -hmm. but um, I'm, I recommend if you're going to get away, get away. And spend the money, you might as well do, yeah. and be gone. Be yeah. gone. Because you you're need to recharge traveling your halfway batteries around the country. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, exactly. So seven right. days is good to go by. That is too cool. And uh, on the screen, of course, the name of the place is Paradise Vacation Escapes. Mm -hmm. And uh, you've been in business how long? Twelve years. Twelve years. So this is not your first rodeo. You've, you, you, you know, you talk to people and find out exactly what they like and dislike yes. and, and match them up. Because I've heard you had some good testimonials and stuff that come in. So sounds like you know what you're doing. Let's go to the next place that we're going to visit. What's the name of this place we're going to? This is Antigua. Antigua. Yes. Okay. And we're looking at um, a Sandals Resort. Oh, wow. I've heard of Sandals. They yes. advertise a very lot. Popular, you know, very popular. Very popular What's, what's so cool about the Sandals Resort? They are luxury all included. So and when you say all included, what does that mean? All your meals, 24-7. Okay. All your drinks, tea, pop drinks, sodas, um, and alcoholic beverages. I see. So if there's a, somebody wants a glass of wine or something. You there, can have one or two, I three see. or four. There, there you go. And okay, another shot of this particular beautiful place. Yep, yeah. looks like we have a pool there, of yes. course. Yes, and they have butler service. Uh -huh. Sandals offers butler service, which is great for couples that are wanting to pamper themselves. Now, compared to the last resort we went to, we showed that was in, in the $10,000 range, mm -hmm. what does Sandals run? Um, sandals is all over the Caribbean. But this particular one in Antigua will start at five thousand mm -hmm. and go up to eleven or twelve thousand, depending on which room category you stay in. Okay. Um, if we go to the next slide, I okay. believe they this is one of their um, higher end ca room categories. Oh, this is actually your room. This is your room. Oh wow, and your own th pool. When, and yeah, it's called a rendezvous. Okay. And so when you get your own rendezvous, you have a butler, and it's a one bedroom suite with a private plunge pool. Wow. And he will. Uh, and that runs about you said twelve thousand for the 10, for the week. Ten to twelve thousand for the week. For the entire yes. week, all inclusive. Okay. All inclusive. And how long does it take to get to this particular place? Um, 
Um, not long. You'll fly from New Orleans, maybe to Miami or Houston, and then down to, to the Caribbean. So, okay. you know, half a day, you leave in the morning and you get there one, two in the afternoon. Okay. Another slide? And uh, one of the Ooh. best things about Antigua is they have a lobster season year round. <laughs> <laughs> so you're served gourmet foods while you're there. Um, and like I said, it, Sandals is a luxury included resort. That is something. Is there another picture of this particular place or is that? Uh, I believe that's the last one, okay. yeah. Okay. Now we're uh, in the Bahamas. We'll talk about Bahamas in just a second. Okay, so you've been doing this for a while and the, how many different, uh, do people tend to like go back to the Caribbean when they go, I mean, they I'm do. sure that you, that do, yes. you find it that because it's close and? It's close, it's easy to get to and there's so many different islands that have so many different personalities. I see. So they may vi revisit the island they just went to or the resort they just went to or they may want to um, go to a different different island and see what their island's about. One of the problems I think people get into is they go to a place so they know it, they're like oh, Disney World and so oh, I'll go back to Disney right. World because I know where I know where to park and I know it. but <laughs> the, half of the adventure is it being somewhere you've never been before. Exactly, exactly. And experiencing that That's whole That's part of thing. the whole journey is the, the trip and and all of the experiences that go along with it. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Okay, let's see another slide. It's going to show us uh, what was it? Where was we going? The Great Exuma in Great Bahamas. Great Exuma. Okay. Yes. Oh, that's pretty. That's isn't a beach now, isn't it? Beautiful beach. Uh, pink sand is what, how they describe it. And this is another Sandals Resort. Yes, this okay. is another Sandals Resort. They call it Emerald Bay. Next picture. And this is, wow. this Looks resort like is described as precedent luxury that meets the island laid back atmosphere. Hmm. It's beautiful there. I know it is. Those palm trees, you always have a nice breeze. Hopefully no hurricane. Next picture. <laughs> Ooh. Yes. All of the rooms face the ocean. Uh, all of their rooms are concierge or butler service. Wow. And again, these are all in the price range somewhere between five thousand and twelve thousand. Yes. So, you know, yes. What's Seven it? restaurants on the property. Wow. And one more shot. Yeah, we have one more. Lots oh. of snorkeling. There's great excursions you can do there. There's lots of fishing. There's even one excursion that you can do that I think is really fun. You can swim with pigs. <laughs> swim with pigs. <laughs> yep. The boat takes you out, and um, just like swimming with the dolphins and the stingrays, they have some some little pigs that, that are on the cool. island and that you is throw cool. food and feed it to them and they come <laughs> swimming to you. <laughs> that is great. I, I, uh, Barbara and I went to uh, Hawaii a few years ago and we, we actually went snorkeling at our age and, uh, and it is a lot of fun. I mean yes. it's really, it, they help you get down in the water and stuff and it was just, it was a lot of fun just looking at all the marine life. It's, it's quite an experience There's just floating. There's a whole other world there. It is, it is, it is. There was people that did the scuba, we didn't do that, but they, uh, right. uh, that, 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 that was too big of a challenge for us at that time. But uh, it, it does look like a lot of fun, it a is. lot of fun. Okay, this particular show, of course, has been about couples, and uh, that brings me to my promotion, which I'm going to give away a $75 gift certificate to the couple that can send me to email me at WLFT.com the best story of how you met, how you proposed, how it all came together for you. I'd like to hear your love story, and I'd like to send you out to a nice dinner at Icky Bonds, a romantic evening for you and your spouse. So if you would, send us your story to email me at WLFT and tell us why your story is uh, so special to you. I'm sure we will uh, enjoy reading it and we want to share it with the people here on the air. And uh, maybe they'll get an idea of how they should propose or uh, maybe uh, something that will change their life. We always need to pass things on. Thank you, Shannon, for being on the show. I hope you win the contest. Next uh, couple of shows, we'll be reading some of them. We'll select a winner here in a few weeks. So be sure to participate. Until then, remember, you can always have a better life through Jesus Christ. I'm Dr. Fries.